morning, you legends. Sorry for whispering. It is currently 5.45 in the morning. I'm uh, up and about. I've been for, I've been up for actually about 45 minutes. Mm. A cup of tea to die for. Um, I've been up for about 45 minutes and I've already been out for a lovely walk with my dog who's gone and laid down in the salt because we got up a bit earlier and she hasn't had a food yet. Um, and now I'm already on my MacBook and I am actually just at the moment going through my um, going through, I've got an app called Trello, which I like to do all my content planning on, and I've got a bit behind. I've been doing a couple of days just on the on the roll, just literally creating content on the day. So I'm just quickly making a content planner for the rest of the month, and then hopefully in the next couple of days, uh, I'm going to set it probably beginning of next week. I will be setting up the rest of next month. And the great thing about setting up the content planner for me is that it's all ahead of the game, it's all sorted and I can just go back to this and instead of actually doing stuff on the day which takes a couple of hours doing all these individual jobs in the day, it can be all brought in together, I can do all the images one day, all the videos <clears throat> another and all the text or something another and actually I've done a week's content in three days in the same time it would have taken to do a daily post. So anyway, enough rambling but today's video I'm just going to be shooting throughout the day I have always wanted to do a day in the life of me and when I'm talking about being a productivity coach when I'm talking about my life the amount of videos I've done I just thought let's get inside let's get behind the scenes and let's do a day in the life of David Pritchard so I've also got work today. This is why I'm up so early. I leave for work at half past six. So I'll be doing this now. You'll be seeing a little bit of me throughout the day and then probably catch up with me more in the afternoon when I'm then back from work. But hopefully I'll be shooting some video while I'm at work. Got a couple of things lined up today. You'll be able to see what I kind of do. Um, but yeah, until then, I'll be seeing you throughout the day. something because I wouldn't want it to die halfway through. <laughs> Why am I doing this? <laughs> I don't honestly know. It sounds really stupid to say but you know when you just get that instinct or you just listen to that voice in your head a day in the life is something I've always wanted to do. It's something I've always wanted to share with people so they get behind the scenes for my life and it's something I've always wanted to do as a challenge for me even as much as that it's, it's, it's for me that i'm almost recording this video because i'm really excited already i've only just started recording yet yeah, i'm really pumped i'm really excited to even get recording and get editing on all of this um and it just goes to prove i've been sat here now for like 15 minutes and i've already done like literally half of the stuff that's on my actual planet so it just goes to show that for some reason, you guys motivate me today. So let's hope that that continued. It'd be great if we could get some real impact done today. The last couple of days haven't been as productive. Um, yeah, if we could be productive today, that'd be great. And the more video I can shoot today for you guys, the better it would be. Maybe not everything needs to be videoed though. Asking you'll probably ever see me get.
10 o'clock, tea break time. What do you think, by the way, of the, uh, the sexy overalls? They're my colour, right? Bring out the, the blue in my eyes. <laughs> um, but yeah, today's going very well so far. Feeling happy about what I got done before I came to work. Work so far today has gone off without too many hitches. Just it's, I only work a half day on a Friday. So it's just catching up on the things that haven't been done during the week. Just getting a couple of little jobs finished off. For those of you who uh, don't know, which probably most of you actually, I'm uh, a maintenance operative is my technical term. And yeah, I mean, there's a lot of different things I cover. Most of it this time of year is actually outside, but we've done a lot of that with the grass cutting, a lot of the weed maintaining all the flower beds and such like that. Um, and today there was one project that's uh, been going on for a couple of days, which we just said, kind of finish that off, get the last couple of bits done in the toilet, as you've seen there. And when I had the paint out, I actually managed to uh, just touch up the wall there, which uh, is drying and it's looking better. It's not uh, a permanent fix, I just thought it'd make it look better. So yeah, today's going well. I'm halfway through the day, only another two and a half hours-ish to go. Then we will be going home and yeah, well, how the rest of the day is gonna go yet, yeah, I'm not entirely sure. We've got a friend coming round, so we're gonna be shooting a bit of B-roll and enjoying the, the rest of our day. I definitely wanna get a bit more work done, so hopefully you'll join me at my desk later. But no, as to what happens for the rest of the day, there's only one way to find out. Something that <laughs> you can always talk about things that you appreciate in life and being grateful for things, but sometimes it's the simplest pleasures that do indeed just make the difference. And one thing I absolutely love that I want to share with you is the fact that I work in the city, <laughs> not like London, I work in Coventry and I used to live there for like 20 plus years. I just love now, I've even though I'm sat in traffic at the moment, um, I love being able to just drive out of the city, drive home to what is a small village through countryside, half an hour drive, yeah, but you know what? It's just lovely to be able to drive out of the city, get away from it all, and granted we've picked a good village. <laughs> We're uh, actually in the middle of uh, quite a few different places, so. But yeah, you know, again, it just makes you realize and just remember that it doesn't have to be the biggest of things in your life that makes the biggest difference. Sometimes it can be the simplest of pleasures. Home just in time for nap time, wasn't I? You're gonna have some sleep now. He's on the phone. You can't reach it. <laughs> right, you're gonna say good night. Even though it's only it's only the afternoon. Say night, night. Leo, can I have a high five? five? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Say see you soon. Look above. There it is. Oh. Yeah, aeroplane. You like aeroplanes, don't you, buddy? Yeah. Is he gone? You not see it past the wall? Oh, you stand up now, you can see it. He's gone, say, goodbye, plane. Gone. He's flying away. <laughs>
is honestly a hell of a motivator in my life. If you haven't told from this video, I don't know how many cups of tea I've actually recorded, but you've seen a couple. Thank you very much for everyone who's watched this video. This is something I wanted to do as a bit of an editing challenge, as a bit of a challenge for me, just picking up the camera in front of people, whether I was at work, whether I was out this afternoon. Now, granted, since I've been home, we have done a couple of bits and pieces. We had a bit of time with uh, my wife's friend and just played a couple of uh, board games and stuff, which I didn't want to start recording that. I didn't want to start recording her. And also, I wanted to just have some downtime. And the same is this evening. So this is why at this point is where I'm going to end this day in my life. It is actually only half six in the, in the evening, but we are I'm just finishing up some work on the computer here and then we're going to be having our dinner, putting our children to bed and then probably just having a bit of a chill ready for Saturday and Sunday, which are quite action packed at the moment. Maybe you might be seeing more from me over this weekend. Definitely make sure you check out the future videos to come. But until then, guys, thank you so much for watching throughout. I really do appreciate your time and really appreciate you sticking through it. And until the next time, guys, stay safe and we'll see you soon.